Listen up, listen up. Now we're talking serious shit, okay? So you gotta pay attention. A knife fight is not a movie fight. I do stunt work in the movies. I don't care if it's a grandma with dementia and you've trained for 35 years like I have. Grandma with a kitchen knife will absolutely possibly kill you. A knife, you're just trying to increase your survivability. Empty hand versus knife is no fun. Even at close range, I'll just carry a gun. Well, at this range, you don't have time to draw a gun. I'm gonna follow the, the draw, maybe one round goes off, I got it in here, or I follow it, and if you, you know, and boom, 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 you already did. You don't have even space. Honestly, that's not the best force option of close. Guys, this is walking up on me, and he goes to grab me. But dude, whoa, what's going on there, what's going on? Okay. I got knit right here, but I don't think I got it. I'll try to break it like here on the way down and maybe keep my feet. I don't know if you guys are able to see the amount of leverage but after he passes and then braces. It, I'm barely holding Like that last one, I, I couldn't even hold on to the knife. There was so much pop there. Hey man, what's up? Hey dude, what's going on here? Hey, what's going on? Someone call the cops! Someone call the cops! Give me help over here! Make sure there's no one else. Minimize that push throw we did to begin with. Oh, it's nice for silly anymore. Minimize the damage, hollow out the body. Oh, I got stabbed, but I'd rather get this than this. To my two on one. See the difference? I stirred his joint. The military, you step on with your boot. Sometimes that, the flexors, boom, I can catch his elbow and then pass. So the same thing, it's a little better to be up here by the elbow because you now he trends at me and slice me up. I can feel where he's going. Okay, go, go. Like, they say something yards in, five yards in, but a whole lot of them take place in center yard. My yard, here's where I'll identify the center And then it can work, I can knee, take it, go. Hopefully I have the sensitivity and the control where I can then work where I need it. Okay? I'm doing seal out. I'll go jam and punch and wrap. I'm hoping I get that bent over. It's very easy to take him over, knee the head, and easily wrist lock that out. And that's when I go over here and I hollow out. What do you want? Come on, come on, let's go. Try to get him talking, and then I go flip out. Keep it to him. Maybe get behind him. Please give me one. Okay, let's go. Let's okay, go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I'll walk. Okay, here, man. Dude, here. Wow. Now I go. Use my shoulder looseness to get my elbow back before I decide to work on something. Yeah, go get feet and you can stab me a little bit. Yeah. I might end up here. I can fight him here because I know how to break his structure to take him down that way. I wiggle it. Okay? So, if you get stabbed in the back, you gotta turn. With your elbow. If it's up high, standing in like the neck, I can go up high with elbow and get a text. Now we're going to find out. Make sense? Any questions about anything? You want a long time? Thank you all for showing up. Hopefully, tomorrow with Nogi, we'll do a lot of submissions. Uh, please uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel at the end, the end of the open. I hope you enjoyed it. We've got a little side track on some stuff. Uh, but it is the stuff that will save you money. It's not always the cool stuff, it's the stuff that will save you money. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Get my DVD, Commander of Street Jiu Jitsu on uh, BJJ Fanatics. It's four and a half hours, it's good value. It'll re ingrain a lot of the stuff we did. Uh, and that's it. Thank you for coming up. See you tomorrow.